Oh, what is good, y'all? It's your boy Hyper Vibes back with another video. So today, I'm going to be making a video: three tips to get better aim in one v one. LOL. And if you follow these three tips, you'll be having aim like this. And also this. Let me, let me show you guys with the AR. I just need to wait for him to go. He didn't even get to finish the full lap, but all if you follow these three steps, you will be having aim like that. So for the first step, you're gonna wanna have a custom crosshair. Now a custom crosshair, I like to use my aim button for my custom crosshair. When you basically, I'll show you how to equip the custom crosshair. You're gonna wanna go to your HUD layout. I'm gonna do this with my Builder Pro um, layout. So what you're gonna wanna do is, you're gonna wanna, so I'm guessing your button will be like over here or something. So what you're basically gonna wanna do with your button is you're gonna wanna come over here and the middle dot in the target button and you see your reticle, like your reticle, like you know how when you're like here, I'll show you real quick like what the reticle is. The, the reticle is basically this right here, the line surrounding that dot right there. That's the reticle. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna get the, um, I'm gonna want to get the the dot in the middle of the aim button and put it exactly on the reticle. Now, it's really not really that hard. You just put it on top of it. I got it right there. Now, what you're gonna want to do is, is you're gonna want to shrink the button until it's about the size of the two lines. Like about right there is perfect. So now, once you have that, you're gonna want to go over here. Now, um, the aim mod isn't really equipped it right now because I set it, so I set it up like so it could be like in a certain place. So, so like, you have to, like, set it up so it's in a certain place so it, like, gets you, like, good aim. Like, you know, you have to set it in a certain place so, like, when you fire it, it, like, does it because you need to have it set up in a place. But in this HUD, it's not in that place because where it is in the place is, like, there's no button right there. So, basically, this is where you're, I mean, this is, like, you get a custom crosshair like this, right? You're going to go over here. That's what ha and then now we use the custom crosshair. Now you're you're not gonna get like god aim from using the custom crosshair. You need to you need to watch my two other steps. So another another step, the second step to having good aim is having low sensitivity. Now, um, like yeah, you need to have low sensitivity. Now my sensitivity is uh, touch fifteen, aim twenty six, sniper fifty six. Now you don't have to copy my my settings if you don't want to, but I honestly believe that my settings are the best for aiming. Now I use fifteen touch because it's the perfect sensitivity because I can crank nineties fast, and like my shotgun sensitivity is pretty fast too, so I can just you know hit people and stuff. And my aim sensitivity, I tested a lot of aim sensitivities. I believe that this is the best one, and my sniper sensitivities. A little bit low, but I it, that's okay. You can make it as much as you want, but I barely even use my sniper. So those, you need to have low sensitivity if you want to have good aim like me. And, um, yeah, let me go switch my HUD real quick. All right. So low sensitivity is another tip on how to get good aim. So make sure you have low sensitivity. You can have, you don't even have to follow these rules if you want, but if you want really good aim, then you should follow these rules. Or if you're like a new player in this game and you want to find good aim or get good aim. But that's the second step. And then the third step is to practice your aim. You see, you see there's free build, aim trainer, and party. You're going to want to click aim trainer. And once you do this daily, you'll notice a change in your aim. Like your aim, your aim will get better if you play this daily. I, I'm trust me, your aim will increase and you will get better aim and you will notice it too. Cause and then the reason why I'm giving you these three steps is because the aim assist in this game sucks and everyone that plays this game knows it too. The aim assist in this game sucks, but by using these three steps, it won't really suck it anymore. Like I, the mod is pretty much on right now, but because like when I'm using a different HUD, it's in like the spot where the the aim the aim mod is like programmed to like it's kind of hard to explain but there's like a certain spot i set up the aim mod so that in that specific spot when i shoot it like on that direct spot it like makes my aim assist better but basically so yeah once you play this aim trainer map daily you'll notice your aim just won't like your aim won't turn like godly once you're using a custom class here in low sensitivity, like, yeah, your aim will get better. But one way to improve it is to do this aim trainer map 
daily. Because if you do it daily, your aim will increase and you'll notice that you're hitting a lot more shots on people than you were before. Let me do it on my shotgun to, like, you notice that your aim will get better daily. And trust me, I'm not lying to you guys. You can search it up on YouTube. Everyone will literally say it. And everyone will say that, yeah, you need to do, you need to practice your aim. And once you do that, you will have pretty good aim. And, you know, I, I recommend doing the right one right over here when you get into the map. Because this is, because this is the best. Because it practices you to, like, track the player when they're moving. Or if they're on high ground and if they're shooting at you. And this, this practices you to just, like, track them easily. So those are the three steps, and I'm going to give you guys a reminder. You need to have the custom crosshair, low sensitivity, and you need to practice this aim map daily, all right? Daily. And I promise you, guaranteed, your aim will be better. So that was the video, guys, for today. Three steps to get your aim better. And for the next video, I'm probably going to do three steps to get editing better. And so, um, yeah, make sure to like and subscribe. Those are three tips to get your aim better. Next video, I'm probably going to do three steps three uh tips i'm either gonna do three tips to get your building better or three tips to get your editing better i'm gonna have to choose between the two but that's the video for today three steps to get your aim better make sure to like and subscribe have a good day stay safe and peace